Good Sunday morning. Well, it's happened again. A horror all too familiar in the United States. This time, the scene of what appears to have been an act of domestic terrorism was a supermarket in Buffalo, New York. A white teenager, a boy really, only 18, wearing body armor and carrying an assault rifle, opened fire at a supermarket in an African-American neighborhood. Ten people were killed, nine of them black, and three others were wounded, two of them black. Shortly after the gunman was captured, a racist manifesto he apparently posted emerged online, filled with racist and anti-Semitic views, including the theory that whites are being replaced by people of color. Authorities say the gunman, who drove some 200 miles to carry out the slaughter, also live-streamed the massacre with a camera apparently on his helmet. It was the latest in recent mass shootings aimed at ethnic groups. Charleston, South Carolina, African Americans in church, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Jewish victims in a synagogue, El Paso, Texas, Latino victims at a Walmart. And now we add Buffalo, New York to the list. We've also, of course, seen a rise of hate crimes against Asian Americans as well. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.